Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So, I know I've been a little distant lately, but I've been super, super busy. Today I will be telling you what are the most easiest plants to have in your household. Okay. Outside, so it's gonna sound a little noisy. I apologize for that. But I will tell you one of my favorites. One of, one of, one of the most, uh, I would say, one of the most uh, easy to care for plant, okay? As you can see, I have this plant right here. This is a pothos, it's a pothos, um, it's a beautiful pothos and this plant right here is beautiful. So you can see it can go really really long, you can hang it up uh, really nice, water uh, once a week, make sure you water once a week, it can last up to, I usually sometimes water it twice a week. Luis, if I must ask, how much did it take you to grow that plant? Um, I don't know why my brother's interrupting me, but let me go ahead and answer his question. So this plant, um, it's one of the newest plants I got. I'm going to show my oldest plant. I'm going to show the plant that I've, the pothos that I've had for three years already. And I will show it to you as soon as I'm done with this one. But this one, water every two weeks. It's really, really, um, not a really hassle plant. It's really, really nice. It has really, really green, beautiful leaves. I'm pretty sure this is common. Pretty sure most of the people have this plant. So if you want to start with a plant, if you want to start with a easy plant, you know, nothing that's too crazy, nothing that you're going to worry about and you're going to be like, oh my God, it's going to die real quick. No. This one, indirect sunlight, bright window. Uh, it can also be in a dark place and it's still grow. Okay, but if you have it in a bright light, it's going to grow faster. It's going to be more abundant and it's going to be nicer. If you have it in a darker place, it's going to take longer to grow. Um, and the color, it might be a little, you know, not, not as green as this one, okay? And not as abundant, okay? So, look at all this new growth, this new growth right here. It's all beautiful new growth. And like I said, you can hang it, this one you hang it up, and then this, all this grows like beautiful, 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 okay? So, this is one of the, one of the plants that I really, really recommend for any beginner, okay? The mistakes, uh, the mistake a beginner does when he starts on plants is you start filling up your house with plants and plants and plants and plants. Do your research and if you're gonna buy a plant, make sure, are your people watching? If you're gonna buy a plant, <laughs> I'm sorry guys, I, uh, there was somebody watching me so I got a little nervous, you know. It's different when you're like somebody watching, but anyways, I am here in my balcony so that's why. Um, so the mistakes people do, like I said, people, if you buy a plant and you start buying and filling up your house, yeah, it's going to look nice and everything, but if you didn't do your research before you buy a plant, it, it can die on you and you're just going to waste money, it's going to die on you. And do your research, you know, I, when I started, when I started off with plants, I started researching, I'm the type of person that I like, I love researching, I love doing research when I buy plants because it is very, very important you do your research on what plants, because some plants are hard to care for, okay, and they need more attention than you really, than you really think, okay? So, this is one of the plants that I really, really recommend, guys. Um, like I said, do your research, please do your research when it comes uh, to you buying a plant, okay? Uh, plants are beautiful plants your house your apartment it's gonna look beautiful nice you know um, you're gonna have that pure air it's gonna clean out the air you know toxins and all that but also it is it is you know you gotta care for it you, know, you gotta water it this one you can you can you can water every two weeks you can water every week uh, make sure the soil dry okay guys so I'm here with my little helper my baby brother uh, introduce yourself my name is Dominic um I'm not really much as a plant lover, I'm more of a video game lover, but I just want to help. Okay, so he just wants to help. So that's good, I have a little helper right now today. So anyways, so this guys, uh, this is my oldest pothos. This is a three year old pothos and I, I will be repotting it uh, later on. I will be taking out all this old dirt and putting in new dirt. So that way it can give it a little boost uh, because I see a lot of new growth and I love that. I see a lot of new growth right here, 
right there in the middle. And this one, guys, was beautiful. So let me tell you a little story on this. The first year that I obtained this plant, this was one of my first plants. This was actually my, my the first plant I had it was a money tree, money tree that I still have there, thank God. So that money tree is the oldest. That one and this one I bought at the same time. So when I purchased this one, I remember I left it outside of my balcony in another apartment that I used to live. And what ended up happening, it was like really nice and, and, and the sun was out and everything. And then all of a sudden it started getting cold and I left it outside and it froze. It, it just it started raining and it was it got super cold that all the leaves got you know uh, got burned by the cold by the cold uh, water and all that and it affected my plants so much. It was so beautiful, it was so big, it was it was like huge, it was like at least six six feet, you know, uh, six foot foot foot. foot. Um, and it was just beautiful and since then I've been having a lot of a lot of trouble with it but I'm not gonna get rid of this one I'm gonna I'm gonna try that I'm gonna repot it on, on new dirt so that way I can see you know it's progress because I'm gonna let I'm not, I'm not gonna let this one go and I've gotten cuttings off of this one and another plant which is this one right here okay I really hope you guys learned something from this video do not make the mistake of you know just going if you're a new beginner if you're a beginner buying plants and just you know go crazy and start oh, i want this one i want that one this and that you're gonna waste your money you're gonna waste your money if you don't know the care of that plant do your research before you buy a plant it is very very important so that way you know your money's worth you know at the end of the of the day and so you can have your plants nice and healthy and you're aware of what is the care for that plant okay hope this video was helpful Hope this video was helpful. Thank you very much. I really appreciate you guys. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you very much. Appreciate the love. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but I was in the background. <laughs>